Going to the gym is one of my favorite things to do. You always seem to run into some type of character. Like, of course you got your casual gym goers, but you also got your weight slammers, your screamers, hoopers that lift too much, the depressed hoodie guy. Yo, you done using that? I don't know. Is she done using me? Lifters that hoop too much, people who work out in jeans. I drew a jail cell because that's where they belong. And worst of all, the old heads that just casually be in the locker room naked as hell. Oh, wow. Okay, bro. I'm going to just walk back. Like, bro, you don't think I see enough meat when I'm getting spotted on the bench? Like, put it away. Golly. Spotting is a whole nother thing, though. You get some muscle and niggas expect you to be a Z fighter. I remember this one time this dude walked up to me and asked me to spot him. I say yes, and then we walk over, and I'm perplexed to find out that he has four plates on the bar. He starts his set, and the whole time, I'm like, if this nigga fails... He's dying! Like, I'm not even gonna touch the bar. There's no point. I could not move this if I wanted to. If he folds, what does he want me to do? Curl this bitch? With me here, the only spot you're getting is a patch of grass in front of your tombstone. But luckily, he does get it. Uh, the weight. The weight. I'm talking about the weight. But if you don't want me curling a Honda Civic, I'm actually a decent spotter because I know what it's like to have a PR ruined. I'd rather die than have a bad spot. Yo, I don't need too much help, but if you do see me struggle, you can grab the bar. Bet. All right, you ready? Yeah, I got you. Oh my, oh my God. I got it. I, I got it. Are, are you sure? Nigga, no, you don't. I got bro, it. Bro, I'm help. Yo, bro, you helped me? Yeah, I said I got you. I didn't need your fucking help. PR or er that's the vibes that i be on bro come monday international chest day i wake up expecting to be on pre-workout or morphine but my gym partner be on bullshit see cheerio the guy from my doordash video introduced me to the gym but he is the worst gym partner to have his sleep schedule doesn't have a schedule or sleep this nigga will hit me up like whoop yo just at four bro, i'll hit him up at 3 30 like you bet and then he'll look at his phone like and then I end up working out alone. I remember this one time he asked me to meet him at the gym at 7 o'clock. I call him at 6.30. Yo, should I take pre? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You should take pre. I'm literally almost done getting ready. I take my pre-workout, which is basically this caffeinated powder that people take to have more intense gym days. So I take it and then dip. I get to the gym at like 7. No Cheerio. So I call him again. Yo, you almost here? This pre's starting to hit. The pre's almost hitting. Shit. Yo, just, uh, just go in and stretch real quick, bro. Like, literally, I'm at the, like... So I get to stretching and 20 minutes go by and I'm starting to like shake and itch because of the pre-workout. Still no Cheerios. So I call him again and I hear water. I'm like, yo, where are you? Bro, I'm on my way, but this fucking rain dog at the traffic I can know. Cheerio. I am on 500 milligrams of caffeine and you on 500 milligrams of cap. Stop lying. Okay, I'm in the shower. Give me five minutes. Stop being a dick. Bro, you always do this. You're always a dick. Oh, I'm a dick. Yeah, you're a dick. Word? Word. If I'm, su if I'm such a dick, then suck me. Bro, the gym closes in an hour. Just, just, just be here in five. Yo, yo, chill. It's me. I got you. I promise. Oh, damn. They closed? So, so what you in tomorrow? Not only does this nigga cost me gains, but he cost me money. Spending $40 on pre-workout to stretch is ridiculous. I spend so much money on various powders that I could be a cast member of Breaking Bad. That being said, supplements are important and you shouldn't be afraid of them. You should be afraid of the smell of old protein shakers. <laughs> Those things are diabolical. They could clear any crowded gym, bro. Honestly, honestly, I might start keeping them on me because the gym just be crowded at the weirdest times. Like, bro, it's 9 p.m. on a Thursday afternoon. There's no way all of us don't get bitches. Like, go home. Cause you in the wrong place. I'ma really get these bars off my chest like a bench and I got a lot on my plate. You think you swole? <laughs> Wait, cause I'ma do a drive-by in a muscle car. He ain't died so I know these bullets must stay. Stomp him out, put my skull crushers on if he try me. Cause skull crushers are a tricep workout. I'ma get my steps in. Bullets hit him like gra gra gra. Only oh, got three reps in. EMS put him on a stretcher now that's really a dead <laughs> This nigga said deadlift, he really raising the bar. Mm. And that's a fact. fact. Milky nigga, that boy cheer up, put holes in your six pack. <laughs> your man's got press when we pulled him. Nigga, get back. back. Cause you be talking to the fans. You really a gym rat? <laughs> but one more, 
one more thing last but not least bro leg day bro when it comes to leg day you just technically these niggas can't get the best of me money can't fit in my pockets my nigga i'm stretching it if it's not about the bread it's so relevant i just got head from a bitch who was excellent took me a break and i bet with it dope put a silence on the blick and they knew i can have a one size fits all any niggas couldn't walk in my shoes said it bro though and you still can't reach it heard it been talking a lot as a recent acting like us i'm a walk in the spot and they get tight lip just like a petite bitch like bro niggas step it up remember the days when i was just an editor Really trailing my niggas, it sounds like a predator. He wanna fight and I told her white body. I don't even need a cat. If you keep a thing too, I'ma up it and blast. She in the passenger seat taking snaps. Gave her my fit and then she gave me cat in the hat. I'm making paper like letters. Shorty be showing the chest, but I wanna put checkers. Heard that you living your best life and you doing your thing, you know I'm doing better. Okay. Yeah, before you die, yo. Oh. I'm not liable. Carl and a Vegas shit. Suicide, dog. Pray before you die, huh? Yo, I'm not hey. buying blue. Yo. I whip my head and break and shit. Yo. My doors are suicide, dog. Yo. Pray before you die, yo. I'm not liable. Niggas are some hate shit, yo. Are you gonna slide, bro?